Sawadee Krap. Welcome to Phuket X Show, brought to you by PSD Windows and Doors. I'm your host, JP Mastanta, and it's Friday, February 14th, meaning the latest edition of the Phuket News is now out. Grab your copy in any one of 600 locations around the island. Now let's start with our top story. 13 street racers, most of them teenagers, they're all now facing charges of illegal street racing and operating modified vehicles after they were picked up in a raid near the Downroom intersection south of Phuket Town last Sunday. Police say they had been receiving periodic complaints about the street racing gang and officers managed to track their whereabouts, moving in for the arrests last Sunday at about 1.30 a.m. in front of Toyota Pearl Phuket, nearby the Daorung intersection just south of Phuket town. As officers moved in, many tried to escape, but police managed to take into custody 12 teenagers and one adult. Four of the males tested positive for meth use, according to authorities. The youths will be charged through Phuket Juvenile Court and the adult will be charged through Provincial Court. A story that has been developing all day is taking place in central Bangkok, where dozens of gunshots were fired from a shop on Chula 10 Road in the Patuwan district of the capital just this morning. No reports of injuries and one arrest was made. Reports say the shots were first fired from a sports clothing shop at about 4 a.m. The locals say that they're being fired by a man in his 40s who's shooting into the air. Police say they were able to calm the man down and he was taken to Patumwan police station shortly before 11 a.m. this morning. Media reports say that the man was 44-year-old Ekachai Charwak Silp, who told police that family problems caused him to open fire and there are no reports of any injuries. The shooting comes just days after a Thai soldier killed 29 people and injured 58 at a shopping mall in Nakhon Rachasima province. One ticket, several systems, it's finally happening. A common ticketing system for all the train systems in Bangkok will be implemented this June, according to the Transport Ministry, despite a number of unresolved issues between the operators. Starting in June, holders of rabbit cards for the SkyTrain, plus cards for the MRT's blue and purple line and the airport rail link, the ARL cards, they will all be able to travel on all four routes without having to buy separate tickets for each journey. There are currently 14.2 million registered cards for all the electric train networks within Bangkok, according to the Transport Ministry, who say that the operators of each system still have to iron out a few terms of business integrations, like discounts for certain groups and the minimum value of stored credit in the cards, among other issues. Officials say that plans are in place for the common ticketing system to expand to cover the public buses public boats, and new electric rail services within Bangkok. Phuket X will be right back after this. Welcome back to Phuket X Tourism officials are again proposing visa-free entry for Chinese citizens as part of a tourism revival scheme following an estimation by the central bank that the economy may grow by less than 2% this year as a result of the coronavirus outbreak. Officials say the Chinese market is likely to drop by 90% in February, but if the containment is effective and the Chinese government lifts its travel ban before the end of March, there's a strong possibility that mainland tourists will return during Songkran in April, according to officials. It's February 14th, so happy Valentine's Day to everyone out there. Here in Thailand, dozens of happy couples flock to Chiang Rai in the north to exchange vows in hot air balloons floating high above the northern province of Chiang Rai. It all happens in the province's Muang district, as 25 couples tied the knot while high in the sky in their hot air balloons. Meanwhile, in Chomburi, 138 Thai nationals who were returned from China's Wuhan city and are still in quarantine, they all received red roses from the Navy at Satahip Naval Base. And that's it for Phuket Extra, brought to you by PSD Windows and Doors. For safe, secure, and soundproof windows, visit pvcphuket.com. We like to get your feedback on any of the news you just watched, so drop us a line in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe. From all of us here at the Phuket News Center, thank you for watching, and until Monday, stay classy, Phuket. คุณมองเห็นอะไรมั้ยครับถ้ามองไม่เห็นเดี๋ยวเราจะย้อนภาพให้ดูทีละมุมถ้ามองจากรถที่อยู่ด้านหน้าคุณจะเห็นชายขี
ถ้ามองจากคนที่นั่งอยู่ข้างทางคุณจะเห็นชายขี่มอเตอร์ไซค์ผ่านไปได้วยความเร็วปกติแต่ถ้ามองจากคนที่ขับรถตามหลังมอเตอร์ไซค์คันนี้มันติดติดไม่มีไฟท้ายก็เหมือนไม่มีขุนอยู่บนถนนตรวจสอบไฟท้ายให้ใช้งานได้อยู่เสมอเ